my name is Esther. It's June 1941, and life in Vilna was pretty ordinary. I woke up just like every morning and looked out my window to see my family's garden. But this ordinary day took a bit of Russian soldiers burst into our apartment. Arrest! Arrest! You're all under arrest. Get down on the floor. Now get up. Pack your things. You're coming with me. Mom, what's going on? Shh. Esther, just listen to the soldiers. Let's go pack our things. Get in the cattle cart. We're going down to the tra train tracks. Ooh. These must be the steps, Esther. Steps? The steps are in Siberia. This is Siberia. You, you work in the mine and drive the horse carts, and you, you dynamite the mine, and you work in the potato farm with the rest of the kids. One year later. <coughs> Father, what is that? What does it say? Father, open it. A letter? For me. Father, what does it say? Darling, what's in the letter? You're turning pale white. Is everything all right? It, it's nothing. It's nothing. I'll be all right. I'm ordered to go near the front lines to work in labor. Front lines. Front lines? Where there's bombings, then wounded and dead. Esther! No! You can't go. Please don't go. Stay here with us, please, where you're safe and away from harm. We must be brave. No, I don't want to be brave. Please don't go. You have grown up so much, my Esther. You can cook, and you can clean, and you can market. Will you grow up just a little bit more? Just a bit? For me? For your mother and grandmother? To get through all this? Father, please don't go. This is a tragedy. How can they do this? Don't worry, Rhea. I will be alright. You will be alright. You are strong. And you will take care of our child. And my mother. After two long years, finally Esther and her mother came back to Vilna, where their father was. Look out the cattle car. Do you see father? Did he receive our letters? Do you see him? I see him. Where? Esther, where? There, with the dark blue coat. Mother, hurry up the cattle car. Here they come. Look how thin you all are. How very thin. The years out there on the step have finally come to an end. Her exile was over. Sir. A note. Oh my, another letter. My brothers, sisters, their children, my aunts and uncles. What? They had went to Germany instead, and not one of them had survived. My brother, sister, Mother, grandmother are dead. They're all dead. If only I told the Russian soldier I knew them, they'd still be alive. Maybe.